Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Penguin and welcome back to Farm Simulator 17 Garage Tour. Today we're going to look at baling technology and this isn't a big category, it shouldn't take too long. Um, there's pretty much, it's the same things from 15, there's, I think there's only one new thing in this category. So anyway, let's take a look. And here we are, so let's start off with the, uh, the Flegel trailer now. You can't really range these in size, I just bought them in the order they were in the shop. So here is the Flegel bale trailer with the uh, the straps. Same one as a uh, FS15. Uh, and there isn't actually a set amount of bales that you can put on this. I believe you could put as many as you wanted on. And with these straps, now I don't know like the height limit of the straps. I guess they could go on for quite high if they wanted to. There, there probably is a height limit. Right. This is new. And I do like the look of this. This is the Arcusin 4 stack. And it's called a 4 stack because it stacks 4 square bales high. Um, and then you uh, So what you do is that you feed them into here, you unfold it, they feed into there, you stack them up. And then you you drive and you kind of like drop them off in like stacks of four, like at the bottom of the field ready to be collected with a like a telehandler or something. I think that's how they work anyway. There was a mod for FS15 that brought this, and it, it it was it was good. I used it a few times, but I expect this to be better. I mean, I expect it to be something like the uh, the auto stack where it's automatic. It feeds it in and does it all automatically. You don't have to because with the mod you had to uh, you had to like raise it up yourself pressing a key and uh, it wasn't it wasn't the best sometimes it glitched and bales would go flying everywhere right over to the Ursus T127 this is the round bale collector trailer again out of FS15 pretty nice I think if I correct it holds one two three four I think it holds eight might hold ten I'm not entirely sure. And then here is the, I believe it's Ursus. Yeah, Ursus Z586. This is the bale wrapper. Didn't use it much. I used I used a mod in FS15 and you actually had to, um, I think it was a crone uh, bale wrapper. It was like a two-in-one thing. And you actually had to fill the uh, the net wrap and the uh, the foil wrap, which is pretty cool. Whereas this, it's just never-ending. Here is the New Holland Roll Belt 150, the round baler out of FS15. The Arcusin Auto Stack for square bales FSX 6372. And this holds 16, I believe. Oh, that's weird. There's something missing on the back there. Oh no. Perhaps it just needs unfolding. Um, yeah, I think it does. And then, last but not least, the New Holland Big Baler 1290, the Square Baler. Pretty cool. I always prefer square bales. They're a lot easier to handle than round bales, but some people prefer round bales. I'm just, I just prefer square bales. Anyway, that's it for this short garage tour of the baling tech. Um, I, I don't know if to like ask what's your favourite, because there isn't much to choose from. If I was going to pick my favourite, I'd just go with a square baler, because that's what my favourite is. But I'd like to use this at some point and see how good this works. I'm, I'm hoping it works how I'm expecting it to. And if so, this could be very useful, especially on the small farms where you can't justify using the giant auto stack. One of these would fit real nice. So yeah, that is it for now. Thank you for watching. Please like, favourite and subscribe. And I will see you next time for some more Farming Simulator 17 Garage Tour. ta -ra.